Puffin' on me high grade, sipping on me liquor Girls, them a come, them a want, them a take her Bad man, me a coming, me a wanna take her Girls, them a come, them a want in on the liquor I steady sipping on my liquor Hello beautiful people and welcome back to my YouTube channel. If it is your first time joining us, thank you so much for stopping by. I really do hope you stay, subscribe and become a part of the ZX family. As you will soon see, Kumnandi and Gulit on these ends. As you guys can see by the title of today's video, today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to do the elastic band method, which is basically a way to actually lay your waist without using any glue yes i'm putting you guys onto the tee of how we actually do this it makes things so much easier when you're going to put your frontal on in the morning or your frontal wig rather on in the morning you don't need to worry about putting on your got to be or anything like that you can literally just get up and go it's something for a more casual look though it's not going to look super glam you can't have the baby hairs and do all of that but it's definitely something for you to wear on a regular day-to-day -day basis if you're just looking for something that's convenient and easy to do in the morning definitely stay tuned if you guys would like to find out how i achieve this Glueless look with just my elastic band. Okay, before we get into that, I do want to give you guys a small and quick little review on the AF Sister Wigs hair. Today I am going to be reviewing a pixie cut wig, guys. This is so far out of my comfort zone. Like my comfort zone is over there. This wig is back there. I literally was so scared to try this wig, but they convinced me and I was like, okay. Okay. And it did make me feel a little bit better because the hair is obviously in my eye. Signature color. <laughs> Anyways, this hair is a pixie cut as I already said. I'm gonna leave the length of it on the screen right now as well as all the other specs, but it is 130% density, it's a glueless lace wig, and it is sort of like an ombre situation as you guys can already see for yourselves. As you guys know, I do love AF Sister wigs. Honestly, it's not about anything else besides the fact that we have great quality wigs at such an affordable price. You literally get such amazing value for money and the service is impeccable. I honestly love working with them. That's why I keep going back because they honestly just make quality products and it's awesome to get to share that with you guys. The hair came super quickly as per usual. I think she said she placed the order on Saturday. Guys, I got this hair on Monday. Like, I was shook. So definitely if you're looking for something to wear before the new year's guys <laughs> i'm saying put yourselves on top put yourselves on the hair came in the standard air sister wig packaging as you guys know you guys have seen this many a times on this channel before it does come with the elastic bands and all of that inside so stay tuned to the next look because i'm going to be showing you guys how i actually use those elastics to create this glueless look okay i first off want to show you guys how the wig looks um, just without me having put any elastic on and just me having adjusted these back straps all the way through okay, Now that the straps are adjusted, I'm just going to Plunk this on my head It does come in a side part already Just so you guys know Woohoo! Okay, so this is how it looks on as you guys can see, obviously this is on, but it's a little bit loose, a lot of bit loose, um, really. I was really, really nervous, guys, to try this out. Like, I was like, is this going to suit me or not? We are also going to straighten the hair in this video, so just know that this is how it looks sort of out of the box situation. This is not, has not yet reached its full potential. What I'm going to teach you guys is how to lay this thing flat, flat, so that nothing moves and that it is way more secure and feels just really really tight on your head we're gonna go off and use this which came in the packet that AF sister wig sent the wig in we're gonna take out the elastic band it comes with elastic band with an elastic band and then it comes with two combs as well but this is the length of the elastic band sometimes AF sister wigs elastic tend to be a little bit small for my head or like will make it'll end up making like the wig like super super tight so I just have to make sure that I don't stretch it too much and also if you sew too close to the edge if you guys can see that if you sew too close to the edge, the elastic band um, starts to fray and then it just doesn't look cute when it's pulling on your hair. So that is a major key when you're making this, um, when you're sewing on the elastic rather. So I'm going to start off by taking the wig back off. And what I need to do first is measure if this is going to be an okay size for me. So what I do is I put it around my head like this 
and then I put it over my ears and then I just lay it down. Now this is me not applying any pressure, not stretching it out or anything, but you do need to stretch it out a bit to actually make sure that it's maximum hold. So I stretch it a little bit on each side and this is how far it'll reach. So this is kind of like a marker for me for when I'm looking at where it's gonna be placed on my wig. Kind of just above my ears, as you guys can see, on both sides. So I'm gonna put my wig back on again. So when I'm looking at where that will lay, it's kind of behind, as you can see over here, it, it was like kind of here, so it's just above where the ear tab kind of curves in. And then on this side, it's kind of the same thing. So it was, it was sitting right here. So kind of just above where the ear tab curves in. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take this white pencil. You can really take any pencil, any color you want. And I'm just going to sort of firstly position this in the way that I want it to sit. So this is how I think it's gonna sit most comfortably. Yes. Okay, so this is how I want it to sit comfortably. It's obviously gonna look different when I straighten it, so don't drag it yet. So I'm gonna take my pencil and I'm just gonna mark where that is. I'll turn my wig back the right way around and then I'm gonna look at where my white dot so my first white dot is there and my second white dot is there so it's on either side because this is obviously the front so it's on either side of the front part of my wig so what I'm gonna do is take the elastic band and first attach it to the first side so as I can see the elastic band I mean the the marker is there so what I'm gonna do is put it like this at an angle right you don't want to put it like this because then it's just going straight to the back you want to put it like this because you know it's going to the other baby girl on the other side curved needle is the best bet and then i'm just using navy thread because i ran out of black but it's not a big deal because no one's going to see it what i'm going to do is sew in a rectangle so from here i'm sewing one two three four i'm so sorry that this is out of focus i don't know what is going on but basically yeah just one two three four do not sew too close to the ends as i've already said because it will fray so i'm going to put it basically on top of that white dot and i'm going to begin sewing i'm not going to show you guys how i sew i sew literally guys do any stitch that you know will stay i sew in a very embarrassing way so i just do not want people to see that and it's not professional sewing or anything like that so I'm gonna fast forward to the part where I'm done sewing. Okay guys, by rectangle, this is what I mean. I hope you guys can see that this is how it looks. Please excuse my stitching, I have long nails, I can't do this grand. Now we are working on getting this to the other side of the wig, correct? Cool. Um, so basically what you do now is, as we put this to an angle, we're also gonna put this at a bit of an angle. So this is gonna go like this. I'm gonna cover it. I'm not gonna take it right on top of the white um, dot. I'm going to move it a little bit higher and at an angle as well so that this is how it is going to sit snug and tight on my head. Now that we are done, I'm just going to put the wig on starting with the elastic band because now obviously we don't need the other compartments. The front is lit. Look at that. No movement. Oh my god. And now we're just going to style the wig. This is most suitable for when obviously you're wearing your hair down. So let's just straighten it and see the finished look.
get to the end of my video. I really do hope you guys learned something. If you guys did, please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Do not forget to comment down below what you guys think of this method. If you're going to be trying it out, if you have already tried it out, how do you find it? Do you find that it's convenient? Let me know. Also, do not forget to subscribe to my channel. We are on the road to 15k, so help us get there by subscribing to my channel. And as you guys already know, I love you so much. Merry Christmas, a happy festive season. Stay safe, don't drink and drive, arrive alive. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!